perception of us. We're some of the worst traders ever, but we just exist to pretty much give stuff away, act as an environment, and take the piss out of each other. <laughs> <laughs> it's so true. Yeah. <laughs> no, I feel like uh, I have to be seven by two. two are we? Okay, I'm back behind your uh, podium. We're about to continue again. All right. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. Did I miss anything? Smuggies. <laughs> Both of you, stop that. <laughs> All right. Did I miss anything? Mm, um, I give uh, I gave away gifts. That was it. And you missed uh, dirty vibes coming in here and sexually harassing every female. <laughs> <in the store. laughs> All right, okay. let's, let's get the show on the road. Come on, let's go. How many right. of those right. are there? Number. All right, everyone. Let's continue onward. Question number twenty-one. Poland Springs Water is a subsidiary of what company? Team Rivals. Poland? Poland? Poland. Every country. 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 Okay, um, in light of everything happening with the voice and everything, this is what I'm seeing in con- I'm seeing that channel failed reading messages from Best Street Voice Center. I'm gonna put it back to the Steam codec, yeah, even though that it cuts people out. If somebody cuts out, you're gonna need to let people know that they cut out. It will take less bandwidth, that's- at least that's the whole point of the codec. But it does cut out, so somebody needs to let others know when that happens. So, uh, just give me a second, let me set that up and see if that will help people getting these net buffer overflows. And, uh, yeah, let me just do that. <laughs> Alpha has been trying to get in for a while, man. Alright, um, the new codec is on. You cut How does that work? You cut out. Uh, the new codec is on. Okay. <laughs> Alpha's blaming uh, me for the kick. I think Robin has to go. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, no, no, man, if you have to I go, am. it was a pleasure to have you here. Yeah, I appreciate uh, it. Sorry for a couple... Oh, so oh, 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 okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Very well. Oh, is Robin lead? Well played, good uh, sir. No. No, Seagull was. Yay! Yay! Robin, yeah, he's you, you realize that not only you are laughing at us, but in the entire Valve company. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Alright, um, we're going to try this again. Uh, Team Brony did have the answer. Nestle. And Destructor just left. This just gets better and better. <laughs> Alright, here we I go. I did disconnect just as I... Wait, Carabetus, can you tell me? Oh, for the off. There we go. Now with that. Question number 22. In the Tenchi series, the main protagonist, Tenchi Masaki, is part Earthling and part what? In the Tenchi Muyo series, the main character, Tenchi Misaki, is half Earthling and half what? <laughs> Hat is not a correct answer. <laughs> Namekian is not a correct answer. Uh, team, let you choose. Uh, Angel? What? Angel. Dear Lord, yeah. I would have accepted Hat as a better answer. <laughs> All right. Uh, Rob, <laughs> I'm going uh, by the Wikipedia here. Uh, Team Brony. Did I hit it? I didn't hit it. Do you uh, hit it? I saw you swinging uh, at it. Uh, no, that was... All right. Ha. Team Rivals, do you okay. have an answer? You kind of... Something about... Is out. Yeah! The correct answer was Jerian. 
I can't, anyway, I couldn't even, I couldn't even like spell his okay, name, so that's why. I let's know. try it again. Um, does anybody have any suggestions about what to do with the voice? Because I'm still getting the air in console, and I don't want people cutting out, especially when people are trying to answer. Um, uh, just, just keep I'm it. not sure, just keep it but right considering down. the point we're at, it is impossible for Team Rivals to win. Congratulations, you have lived up to my expectations. Yay. Off to space for you. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> 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 oh yeah. Tragic <laughs> into space. God, I love oh, it. Oh, that was from Pink Doctor. Can we have their podium? Uh, no, get back to your podium. Oh. Uh-huh. Catch this, catch this stupid. Wait, why did you get the podium? Alright. Question number 23. Actually, before we begin, let's just narrow things down a bit. Both teams are currently tied with seven points. We have three questions left. All right. Ooh. Here we go. Question 23. Zoologists and paleontologists use what two words to refer to a typical collection of animals and plants found in a specific time or place? I'll give you two words, and this is a family game, though, so I can't share with them. <laughs> oh, God. Zoologists and paleontologists use what two words to refer to a typical collection of animals and plants found in a specific time or place? I would like to point out to the people who are new here that this is how I roll. I ask one question that's pathetically simple and then I follow it directly after with something that's increasingly difficult. If somebody actually gets this without the use of Google, then congratulations. That tells me that you're in college and that you're currently learning this. Team Brony. I'm just gonna take a wing at this because I'm not good at science. Unless it's uh, a frog. Uh, binomial nomenclature. Uh -huh. You just said it for gnomes. Species? No, tell me the something. Yeah. Did, you just, did you just type the first scientific thing that came to mind? And then just decided <laughs> that was the correct answer? Do you have a name? We'll let Len. Yeah, he right. map quested uh, it. Team, let me choose. Do we have an answer? <laughs> he map quested it. <laughs> Should we break the frame one more time? I'm sorry, but time is up. The correct okay, answers sorry. were. I wasn't gonna. Full, the correct answers were flora and fauna. That's what I thought. So oh, oh, what? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Smug, you're bad. Yeah, Smug. <laughs> I know. I warned you. <laughs> well, just look on the bright side, Scuffy. You can have garden gnomes. Not the bees! Yet. Moving along. Oh, God, oh, no. That's, that's worse. worse. That's worse. <laughs> Remember, everyone, the United States is not a country. Just <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think I think we found this week's Archimedes. And he's a regular here, too, so it makes it even better. <laughs> Wait, who? Is that a smuggler? Um, okay, the fact that it went clear over his head makes it all the better. Question 24. I was kind of <laughs> In the Steam Summer event, what is Tokitori supposed to do? Uh, die. Team, let you choose. You want to answer this one, dude, since I've been doing most of them? Yeah. Turn your mic, I'm sorry, what? You should say in the sun. That is correct. Good job, buddy. Go team. We're down to our last question. If Team Bruni gets it, we're going to have a tiebreaker. If Let You Choose gets it, they win with a two-point lead. If nobody gets it, they still win with a one-point lead. Very well. Let's win this. Question 25. That's the blood team. <laughs> Question 25. In TF2, what class has the most vintage items that can only be used by that class? No one's allowed to backpack me. Team Brony. <sighs> Demore? <Demand>? No. <laughs> Incorrect. <laughs> You know what? You're not allowed to back there. Okay. Yeah. Team let you choose. Doesn't matter, but I'm gonna guess Scout. Incorrect. The 
correct answer was oh, Pyro. Oh, we went full oh, circle oh, with that one. Oh, so after, oh my God. let you choose with eight points. Congratulations! You are tonight's grand prize winner! Pocket Doc. Yay! 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 Yeah, yeah, I should have go. gotten more questions. I didn't get any gifts from Carabitas. I didn't get any gifts from it. Uh, Everyone, everyone's well, a winner. Robin got a third dip. Oh, so I lose. With that much said, uh, team, let you choose. Sweet. <laughs> wow. Well, uh, who would like to receive the uh, Western Bear Bundle, and who would like to receive the Heavy Mall Cup? Uh, I, I prefer the, the engine stuff. I don't know. All right. Yeah. Do are you all right with receiving the Mall Cup, or would you two like to uh, fight over that? All right. <laughs> Feathered will receive the Texas 10 gallon and the Teddy Roosevelt. Do will receive his uh, mall cop kit. I don't know either of those names right now. Mainly because they're new and I don't have them. Sad face. Security think, uh, shades and... Robin's trapped. Thank you. <laughs> and... As for Team Brony, they will receive two hats of a choice of a few of them that I have selected from my backpack. Oh shit. I'll check. Team Rivals, <sighs> congratulations. You get the prize of disappointment and failure. However, Yay. unlike the previous time where Garden Gnome received failure, he will not be receiving an Ellis cap with the name tag failure on it. <laughs> <laughs> As for our two audience winners, Reach, uh, Reach and Gardas, you two will each be receiving a paint for your entry for that. That much said, thank you all for joining us. We'll be here Welcome. next week, a little earlier hopefully, but once again, yeah. same time, same place setting everything up. We're going to still have the weekly events, and sometime tomorrow we're also going to be giving out week seven of the clues contest. So, for those of you who don't know what that is, the uh, clues contest is a specific event. It's free to enter. Uh, the entries are in our Steam group. All you have to do is go there, find the uh, each week's clues, and give both week's clues to the certain address that are listed. The winner of that is a Bill's hat. Now with that much... Wait, instead of exploding... Hey, Garden, kill us. Yo, Garden. Thank you for joining us on Pink Taco. I don't care if you're being served. Oh, God. Oh, my 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 God. Gift overflow. That was, that, was, um, that, that, was, that was Mrs. You. Of wow. course she gets it. It's dirty. I didn't get one at all. <laughs> what are you talking about? You got a hottie's hoodie. No, the first <laughs> one time I got a hottie's hoodie. What's not fair? First, all right. If we could, I, uh, I will just say, I will just say this to finish it up. Robin Walker, thank you for joining us for this event. Thank you, Robin. I thank you for coming. You here. Definitely appreciate you coming by. You're a good Absolutely. man. Thanks, Robin. Yeah. You're awesome. Robin, I am sorry for the patch now. I'm sorry for the uh, patch. Oh, and also, you should, you should bring you should bring a microphone next time and actually play. <laughs> yeah. Oh, push or push and, uh, yeah, uh, pre-record uh, your voice. <laughs> pre-record oh, your oh, voice and then use voice and push from fi uh, from <laughs> file. Uh, that you could do that. Well, would I have to give him the questions ahead of time? Well, well, no, I mean he could just be like. Hello, I'm Robin Walker. I just play that over <laughs> again. <laughs> Somebody asks. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, well, this uh, is a bit uh, off topic, uh, but I I was I was told to ask you this, um, Robin. Um. Bring me from man. concussion grenades from Team Fortress class. Did Robin just leave? He's right here. Uh, He's right no. there. Still here. Yeah. yeah Robin. Where is he? He's a soldier. He's in blue spawn. All right, Robin. Um, I need to oh, ask it's you, so it's not so much a question, it's not um, so much a game, it's more so simply a community. 
we do have like a lot a of people who yeah. come in here. We do have an actual large amount of people who try to come in uh, every week. However, it's just something I do because, honestly, Team Fortress 2 has been one of those games that really changed my perspective on gaming as a whole. It's one of those games.